Good afternoon everyone. Hello. Welcome to Max Public Land Hunting and Outdoors. Today I'm going to show you, I'm not going to show you everything about this because I'll be on a roof. I bought an Ed Fong, F-O-N-G, J-Pole GMRS antenna. This is, I think it's about 50 bucks. I'll put a link to the description in there and the price on it. I can't remember the exact price. Comes like this in a package, rolled up. You got a PVC end cap. You've got this protecting the coil during shipping. You take and slide this off when you install this. Straighten this end of the antenna out. They don't send, you need a 37 inch piece of PVC pipe, 200 PSI. It can't be the schedule 40. It doesn't give the radio waves good through it. It has to be the thin, thin wall, 200 PSI. But anyway, because of shipping, it would be so much to ship something that long, you buy the 37 inch piece of PVC pipe on your own, which I've already done. And I've got the cap on it. And what you do is you take this, slide it up in there, and put the cap on the bottom. And I've already got a little bracket up on my other antenna mast. I'm gonna go up there and I'm gonna show you it mounted. Anyway, this thing should work well. All the reviews say it works wonderful. One of the best out there. So I'm gonna get on the roof and we're gonna put this thing up, see what happens. Okay guys, I've already opened it up. What you wanna do, I've taken the tape off of this. It was tape on it. You wanna take that off. Do not open these up. Those need to stay in a tight coil, but straighten this out. Straighten that wire out. That way it slides in the pipe easier. There you go. Now I'm just got to go get up on the roof and mount it. Okay, everyone, I've got it mounted. I didn't want to be up here on the roof mounting this for safety reasons while I was filming. So anyway, it's mounted right there. That's my Antron 99. It's got a 1.0 to 1.1 SWR on 10 and 11 meter. That's my Ed Fong GMRS. I made this bracket. I welded some metal together. Put it right here. It's clamped onto that. This is clamped onto here. I'm just going to wire tie the uh, cable up. So let's do this. Okay, there's my Ed Fong J Pole antenna right there in the center. And there's my Antron 99. 10 10 meter and 11 meter antenna. Okay everyone, we're gonna be doing a range test on my new Ed Fong j -Pole antenna. Also antenna, everything I've read about it, it's gonna work wonders. We're using the Simcom radio. It's a five watt radio. I'm on frequency 462.6250, which is the GMRS channel. I've got this Surcom um, SWR meter. Let's see if this is focused. Let's transmit, see what the SWR is. One. 4.50 watts and one on the SWR. That should work good. The antenna is perfectly aligned. All right, everyone, we're two miles out. Audio, 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 two miles out. Audio, 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 two miles out. This is the Samcom, five watt walkie talkie, GMRS, two miles out. Trying to reach the Ed Fong base antenna, two miles out, WQRZ. All right, guys, hopefully that. I did a little test before this and I had the squelch turned up, so now I've got the squelch turned down. Let's go to three or four and see what happens. Audio, 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 two miles out. Audio, 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 two miles out. Five 
Watt, Walk and Talkie, you know where it is, two miles out. Trying to reach the headphone base antenna, two miles out. Okay guys, the two mile test did okay. Not as good as I thought it would. Four miles, I'm not going to show that. It barely came through at four miles. The squelch was cutting it in and out. And it's not the Ed Fong antenna. The Ed, the Ed Fong antenna is 30 feet up there. The problem is these rubber ducky antennas on these things. And they're not bad, but they're just short range antennas. And that's what they are. So this is for hunting, you know, being in the woods, hiking with your family. You might get two miles out of this if you're lucky, more like a mile, mile and a half. So anyway, what I need to do is I need to find somebody with a GMRS base, like I'm trying, like I'm talking to now uh, with the Ed Fong antenna, that's a GMRS base. I have it hooked up to a mobile radio, but that's a base station. Um, so what I've done is I've come to my local four-story or five-story parking deck and hope, well, this is three miles away, so hopefully you're going to hear an improvement over the two miles away because this at two miles being five foot off the ground or six foot off the ground, I'm six foot three, tr talking to the 30 foot tall up high Ed Fong antenna, you know, this is hindering it. So now I'm four or five stories up. One, two, I'm actually five stories up. So at three miles away, we're through right at three miles away right now, I should actually talk to my Ed Fong antenna better than I did at two miles, just because of the hive. But we're gonna see. Okay guys, we're on the right channel. Like I said, I'm five stories up. So be, this is more like a base antenna, even though it's still a rubber duck antenna, talking to a base antenna. So let's see how good this does, or who knows, we're gonna find out. Audio, audio, audio. This is the Samcon 5 watt mobile radio walkie talkie, five watts of power, talking to the Ed Fong antenna, three miles away. I am five stories up five stories up audio 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 all right guys let's go check it out it should do a lot better um but what i really need to do is i really need to find somebody with a base antenna like i've got maybe five or ten miles away and, and do a test on that so i'm gonna start the search for that i probably have to get on some online forums to find that person but let's go back and check it out All right, everyone, hope you enjoyed that test. I am getting more range out of that. I'll post a link or put it up there where I did a range test on that same radio. I've got two of them, ground to ground. I was getting a mile, pretty clear, but after a mile, it really petered out, went down, way down. Um, so I'm getting two to three times the range using this antenna up here and the height of the antenna. You know, really antenna is everything watts does mean a lot but antenna is everything or most everything when it comes to you know rf frequencies um so i am getting two to three times the range but i'm still only using five watts through this i really need to get a base where i'm pushing at least 25 or 50 watts out of this this is designed for 75 so i'm also going to find a ham guy i've got some ham buddies hopefully they've got some gmr radios they can use on some of their antennas and see how far I can go from base antenna to base antenna. But I did get about three times the range out of this. Um, so anyway, guys, let me know how you like it. Leave some comments. Um, height fizz everything on the antennas too. This could be a little higher. But anyway, guys, like I said, leave some comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.